What is going on? Welcome to the channel. My name is Mattia and today we're here. It's Halloween, first of all, and we're here with a new email from scratch. It's going to be a great email, like an incredibly unique email because I've never done anything like that. I've never seen anybody doing anything like that. But for copywriting's sake, we are going to do something like this. We're going to create a horror sales email for Halloween. And uh, I sent this prompt also inside the Jubis, the Jubis Cave, which is my Discord server. If you haven't joined yet, it's free to join. You find the link down here. And where I give prompts like this every single day and people practice, then send the, the email into copy reviews and people just review each other's copy. That's how you get better, guys. That is how you get better. So today I sent that prompt there, but now I'm also going to challenge myself and I'm going to write the email. The prompt is, today's Halloween, so write a horror sales email for a female business coach aged 35, trying to get people inside her 101 coaching plan. She's running a 24-hour Halloween promotion, 40% off, for the next three people who join. The avatar is a woman of age between 25 and 34 who, have a sm who has a small business and wants to scale to six figure. Now, I already chose a subject line. I already have an idea on how I want to structure this email. The subject line I chose is POV, POV a clown attacks you. It's kind of kind of funny. And we're going to start from there. We're going to just start to create a, a, a story. This is kind of content writing, storytelling. It's part of uh, the job when you work with personal brands or when you're a personal brands copywriter. Because people are not only bots who you have to sell to they have emotions they want to read stories they want to be inter entertained so for that reason we're gonna do some entertainment today so i say let's start hey first name mm. actually i'm not gonna start with a first name this time they're gonna be different so we're gonna do something like Is tomorrow no uh, mm. it was Friday Friday seventeenth November twenty twenty three you are you had a very stressful day at work. You just got home after a very stressful day at work. You take off your clothes and had to the shower. Mm. It's seven PM. You just weather outside. The weather is foggy and rainy. You just got out of the office after a very stressful day. You get in your car and head home. You pull into your driveway and You pull into your driveway and you notice the kitchen's light is on. No, the upstairs or the garage with light. The garage's light 
and so on. You must have forgotten it earlier. That morning. So you had in the garage, so you head into the, so you open, you head into the garage and turn the light off. You then then take out your keys you then take your keys out of your bag and try to open the front door but to your surprise it's unlocked Sounds already scary to me, not gonna lie. Friday, 17 November 2023. It's 7 p.m. The weather is foggy. The weather is foggy and rainy. The weather is foggy and it's pouring rain. You just got out of the office after a very stressful day. You get in your car and head home. You, 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 you. Uh, you just got out of the office after a very stressful day. All you want to do is going home and have a hot shower. So you get in your car and head on. As soon, however, as soon as you pull into your driveway, into the driveway, you notice something is off. The garage light is on. You must have forgotten me early that morning. You must have forgotten it earlier. You must have forgotten it on early that morning, you think. So you had. So you go ahead and. and turn it off with a. So you go ahead and turn it off. You then take the keys out of your bag and try to open the front door. But to your surprise, it's unlocked. No big deal. I must have forgot it earlier in the morning. So you go ahead and turn it off before going to the front entrance you take your keys out of your bag and then try you take your keys out of your we need to give a good detail here you then you take your keys out of your bag and try to open the front door
Just use it to be out of your bag and try. Take your keys from your bag from the side pocket. You insert them inside the inside the door lock. Turn the key, but and turn and turn the key, but to your surprise. It's unlocked. Your heart skips a bit. First, the garage light. Now, the lock door, not the door lock. Can't be a coincidence. So you slowly get inside you take your phone to try and call your friend Lucy. But the battery is completely, but it's completely out of battery. And the phone is completely dead. Take your phone, try and call your friend Lucy, but the phone. But you remember. It died a few minutes before. But you remember? So, so you can't call. The only solution is to get inside the house and use the house phone if anybody even have has, still has that you know so you take off your shoes and slowly get inside and slowly takes steps towards the kitchen counter where you have the phone. You manage to reach the phone and you start typing and you start typing Lucy's phone number. Three, five, nine. Bing, bing, bing. You notice something. Now we need to make the clown. It's, this email is funny. Bing, bing, bing. Lucy's 
25 minutes is phone number. Bing, bing, bing. All right, let's read it for a second. Friday, 17th November 2023. It's 7 p.m. The weather is foggy and it's pouring rain. You just got out of the office after a very stressful day. All you want to do is go home and have a hot shower. And all you want to do... So you get out of your car and head home. You pull into your driveway. And you can't... And you notice something is off. And and a few seconds after, not something is off. The garage lights is on. No big deal, you think. You must have forgotten it earlier that morning. So you go ahead and turn it off before the front. Before. Off and head. Head to the front enders. Take your keys from the side pocket of your bag. You insert them inside the door lock and turn the key. But to your surprise, it's unlocked. Your heart skips a bit. First the garage light, now the door lock. Can't be a coincidence. Take your phone and try to call to try and call your friend Lucy. But you remember that the battery died a few minutes before, so you can't call. So you can't use it. The only solution is the only solution is to get inside the house and use the house phone. So you take off your shoes and slowly take steps toward the kitchen counter where where the phone is. Where the phone is. You manage to reach it and you start typing Lucy's phone number. Three, five, nine. One more number, seven. Wait, what was that? Turn your... A noise from behind takes, steals your attention. Steals your... It was a noise came from behind you. You turn to check what it is and now we're gonna put a clown face. Okay, happy Halloween, first name. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to scare you. No. However, if you found this email scary, then you definitely love this discount. Horrific. Okay, okay, okay. I think this can make it. This can do it. Yeah. Now, right here, we're probably going to write 24 PS. 
mm, less than 24 hours the price will go back to normal only the fastest five how many are them five or three only the fastest three people will get will benefit from this horrific discount make sure it's you click here and and save your Halloween spot now click here and build scale your business like something like horrifically easy no but mm, and scale your business just as for hours the price will go back to normal only the fastest three people will benefit from this horrific discount make sure it's you click here and click here and save your halloween spot now yeah this will make it it's a weird email so friday 17 november 2023 it's 7 pm the weather is foggy and it's pouring rain you just got out of the office after a very stressful day and all you want to do is go home and have a hot shower so you get in your car and head home you pull into the driveway and a few seconds after you notice something is off the garage lights is on no big deal you think you must have forgotten it earlier that morning so you go ahead and turn it off and head to the front entrance. You take your keys from the side pocket of your bag, you insert them inside the, do the door lock and turn the key. But to your surprise, it's unlocked. Your, head your heart skips a bit. First the garage light, now the door lock. It can't be a coincidence. You take your phone and try to call a friend, Lucy. But you remember the battery died a few minutes before, so you can't use it. The only solution is to get inside the house and use the house phone. So you take off your shoes and slowly take steps for the kitchen counter, where the phone is. You manage to reach it and start typing Lucy's phone number. Three, five, nine, seven. Squeak. Wait, what was that? It came from behind. You turn your head. You, you turn to check what it is and... Right, that's it. That's it, literally. Happy, happy Halloween, first name. Sorry about that. I didn't mean to scare you, lol. However, if you found this email scary, then you'll definitely love this horrific discount Juby. in less than 24 hours the uh, in less than 24 hours the price will go back to normal only the fastest three only the fastest three people will benefit from this horrific discount make sure it's you click here and save your halloween spot now i think it would work to be honest i really think it would work i could I could run it for my business, for my personal brand. I think my my audience will would like it. But yes, guys, this was a funny email. Still, you can learn a lot from this one because we used the visualization uh, method. I already did an, a video on an email of this type, and it works very well. Visualizing things is very well. Not a horror thing, but if you visualize the dreams of your reader, it's going to be much more powerful. So I hope you learned something somehow. I hope you got entertained because entertainment is a way of value. I'm sure you learned something today. And if so, please leave a comment, drop a like, share the video, whatever you want to do. It helps. Subscribe, maybe join the Discord. That would be the best move. But yeah, I really appreciate you, your attention and your time. And I'll see you in the next video.